the model uh, as an architectural form is something that I feel was really important for me when I started thinking about painting, when I started thinking about what, a, what an artwork is and the relationship of the architectural model and how it might inform rethinking about uh, an artwork. Um, and all work in general. And it, it struck me that the, the, the model um, has uh, more or less three different states. Uh, and uh, do uh, let me know more states uh, if you think of them uh, at the end. But um, there's the state of the model where you make something of something that already exists. So something already exists in the world and you, uh, you make a scaled version of it. Uh, whether that's one-to-one -one scale, whether it's bigger or whether it's smaller, you're making a model of something. And that's a representational uh, form. And it's of the past, in a way. It's a, it's, a, it's a past tense. Then you have the model, which, as I say, is experimental or playful. Um, and it's very much in the presence. The thing about the model being on a table is that uh, it's not on the plinth. It's not formal like sculpture is. Um, I'm kind of interested in the uh, reclining figures uh, uh, on the corners of the, uh, of the, um, the basin uh, outside because there's, they're, they're very much as sculpture, uh, whereas models have a different kind of status. Uh, they don't really belong on, on the plinth. Uh, they belong on the table or they belong falling off the table on, on the floor. And they have, in that sense, the capacity to draw other things in. Uh, and other things become models or get turned into models. Uh, the detritus, uh, the, the pieces of furniture, whatever, uh, all become part of, part of the model. Uh, so there's an there's a expansive potential. And this is very much the experimental um, form of the present, the present tense. And then you have the model as a kind of utopian proposition. Uh, there's all kinds of models that you think uh, and, and project into the, to the future. Uh, they're idealized, they're conceptual. Um, uh, some are dystopian, some are utopian, uh, some are just asking what if. Um, so you have the model crosses the different tenses, the past, the present, the future, and allows for this uh, play. Um, and I, I was always struck by the fact that the model is essentially pragmatic as well. It can be incredibly poetic, uh, but it's still also something that is just put together with, with scotch tape, with glue, um, and can be turned upside down. 